Hi guys, thanks for joining me so today. I'm a bit swamped by the carrier bag and um, this is actually a Morrison's. So Morrison's is a supermarket, I think it just used to be down south in England, but now we get it up here in Scotland. We've had it up here in Scotland for a number of years and recently they've introduced um, a clothing range into our local Morrison's, well my old Morrison's, not local to me anymore. And so I just kind of thought I would show you what I've got. So this isn't clothes obviously, so they do a section where everything's a pound. So these were prism um, wood that is just flashing up as well there. Prism um, wood floor wipes. I've not got a horse in the kitchen, it's a dog having a drink. <laughs> I also have run out of plasters. The only plasters I have were tiny little pink ones that I think we'd bought for Freya one time. Um, so I thought I'll get some plasters. Those were only a pound as well, which was good. I also got some ice cube bags. Um, so you, you fill them up with water, you tie them and you throw them in the freezer. So those come in handy. I don't tend to have ice cubes, but my son has got one of these big um, chilli bottles and so does Antonia, his girlfriend. Um, they pop ice cubes in them, but the the kind of the old fridge freezer that we had had a small tray for ice cubes. This freezer behind me actually has in the drawers it's ice cube trays. So we just discovered that. But these are handy for if you want to have lots of ice cubes and things. And I also got some of these. These were only a pound as well. I am always losing hair baubles. And um, when Freya comes to stay as well, um, these come in handy. So I'll give Freya some to take away as well. And I'll keep some here. I bought her a little hairbrush. And in the hairbrush, um, you unscrew the lid and you pop your hair bobbles in. And I thought it was a good idea because I'm always losing hair bobbles. Um, so I was really good to see those. I also bought myself, this is really boring, a, pa a pack of four um, high brief, um, high leg brief um, knickers. I love the ones with the wee stars. Those were only £4.50. I also got myself um, some new socks. Now, these are, it says they're luxury socks, but it's three for four pounds. Um, but I just love the patterns on them. They reminded me of like tights I used to get when I was wee. You know, the kind of Laura Ashley type tights. So um, those will be nice for the winter. Uh, what else did I get? Oh, really boring. Nail brush. Threw out my old nail brushes when I moved. My son was complaining. I did actually also get a hair brush, but I think he's taken it out. So I thought I would be organised for Christmas and I love this. So this is the the, um, the Bardot type top and it's got the nice Breton stripe but um, I don't know if you can see it, it's got gingerbread men, Christmas puddings, um, Christmas trees, baubles, presents and they're all, some of them are upside down, some of them are the right way round. Um, but I just thought that would be really cute for um, kind of Christmas. Uh, I don't like wearing Christmas jumpers because I get too hot in the office. So I thought that might be quite nice when we do the Christmas jumper day. Or we do quite a lot of fundraising at work. So we're fundraising at the moment for the Butterfly Trust, which is the local cystic fibrosis trust for children and families. And... Um, We've got a member of staff in the office whose daughter has cystic fibrosis, so it's a charity that's kind of close to everybody's hearts at work for that reason. So it's the charity of the year, and we're doing like, we do Christmas Jumper Day every year, but it goes to the charity um, of the year that we're supporting. Um, we're also doing like a Christmas fair. Um, we've got a Christmas choir, carol day singing, raffles, all the rest of it. So I thought that would be quite nice for, maybe when we're doing the Christmas stalls and for Christmas Jumper Day. And I also got this, it was only a tenner, but it's not, it's not woolen as such. Well, it is woolly, but it's not, I don't know how to describe it, but um, it's kind of like a fine knit. Um, so it's long sleeves as well. So I kind of thought that would be ideal for the, the winter. Again, it's not too thick for me. I don't like to be too hot, but sometimes when you're kind of in and out, having a bit of a longer sleeve, I wear lots of shorter sleeves. Um, having a longer sleeve might be helpful. So anyway, 
thanks for watching i hope that wasn't too boring for you but um just if you've got a local morrison's if it's got a nutmeg pop in and um, the quality is really really good that's where i get all these t-shirts from um that i wear they're either from nutmeg or from marks and spencers but they wash up just as well um, as the Mark Marquis ones um, and the plain ones are £6 that one was £6 as well with the the stripes um, so I was really pleased to pick that up and I thought it'll sell out so I've got it in advance so anyway guys, thanks for watching, speak to you soon, bye